Hello everybody, welcome back. Here's another video as far as uh, Windows 10 uh, bugs are concerned. I sent an email out letting everyone know. Probably the, my recommendation is to wait 30, 90 days frankly. But here I'm going to show you an example of something, uh, an upgrade that went uh, went wrong. This computer here has uh, functions. If you look at the 1, 2, 3, 4, it has a separate function. And then the uh, space bar has a function as well. And so what's happening is if we type one, two, three, four, we get nothing. We have to hit the function key along with one, two, three, four to get that. Pretty inconvenient. Not only that, but the space as well. If we want to get a space, we gotta hit space, I mean function space. Also pretty darn inconvenient. Uh, so this is something this software went wacko. Uh, most of the other functions up here in the in the uh, the keys don't work either. For example, the uh, here's the brightness up. Uh, well, brightness up went into a spell check. <laughs> I didn't even know that. So brightness up doesn't work, which is right here. Brightness up gives us well go back one more time let's go with the function key let's go function brightness so as you see the function brightness doesn't work either that's not really a big giant deal so what but this uh, having to hit your function key for these numbers and frankly on this computer not too bad he's got a numeric keypad over, keypad over here so you could probably do that but he's only got one space bar so from now on when he types he gotta hit function space bar to get those spaces up there. Pretty inconvenient and that's why uh, my recommendation is uh, hold off on your excitement with your Windows 10 upgrade. Um, 30 days bare minimum if you just can't hold yourself back. Frankly I'd wait 90 days. You're gonna have about a year to upgrade anyways for free so don't worry about it. Let everybody else go through these uh, bugs and I'll keep you posted. Thanks for watching.